To illustrate how important sensory details are to a great story, I'm going to read from The Lightning Thief, and I'm actually going to take out the sensory details. And then we're going to add them back in, and we're going to compare. I think you'll notice the difference right away. For context, this is the scene where Percy is running away from the Minotaur with his mom when he's trying to get to Camp Half-Blood. The bullman tried to knock me off. I held on. We were in a rainstorm. The monster shook and tried to hurt me against a tree. I realized nothing would stop him. Grover groaned on the ground. I wanted him to be quiet, but I was busy with the monster. Food, Grover said in confusion. The bull man turned to Grover and looked ready to charge. I remembered that the bull man killed my mom, and I became angry. I grabbed the bull man's horns and squeezed with all my strength until it broke off. You've probably noticed it's a little confusing without the sensory details. I really butchered this scene. Now, I couldn't take out all the sensory details, but I did my best. Now, let's look at the original. The bull man staggered around, trying to shake me. I locked my arms around his horns to keep from being thrown. Thunder and lightning were still going strong. The rain was in my eyes. The smell of rotten meat burned my nostrils. The monster shook himself around and bucked like a rodeo bull. He should have just backed up into a tree and smashed me flat, but I was starting to realize that this thing had only one gear, forward. Meanwhile, Grover started groaning in the grass. I wanted to yell at him to shut up, but the way I was getting tossed around, if I opened my mouth, I'd bite my own tongue off. Food, Grover moaned. The bull man wheeled toward him, pawed the ground again, and got ready to charge. I thought about he had, how he had squeezed the life out of my mother, made her disappear in a flash of light, and rage filled me like high-octane fuel. I got both hands around one horror and pulled backward with all my might. The monster tensed and gave a surprised grunt, then snap.